When Stephanie says quarantining with Blake Shelton and her kids was magical. When the coronavirus pandemic began, Blake Shelton and Gwen Stephanie headed to Shelton's ranch in Oklahoma, where they spent the next several months of together along with Stephanie's three sons, Kingston, Zuma, and Apollo. In a first look at the upcoming season of The Voice, the coaches open up about the quarantines, which Stephanie called magical. We don't ever have that much solo time together, she explained. We did do a lot of fun stuff. We did a lot of cooking and I learned how to make sort of bread like everybody else. It took me like a month to get started right. We did so much stuff. We built a garden, we planted zinnias. I mean, we planted thousands of zinnia flowers. It was a lot of stuff that you dream about doing that, but you never have time to do so. Shelton confirmed that one of the group's preferred activities was spending time in the kitchen. This summer during quarantine, I learned to how to make jam, he said in the clip, which also provided photo proof. I have about six or eight peach trees, and every year they make a bunch of peaches, and we eat them. But this year, since we were there and there were so many, and there was nothing else to do, we got online and we learned how to make jam. We've made like cases of peach jam, and there's a lot of work. Probably will never do that again, but I know how to do it. Stephanie and Shelton's life at home in Oklahoma was documented in the music video for the recent release duet, Happy Anywhere, which they filmed themselves in the help of Stephanie's brother, Todd. There was a camera shooting the things we do every day, Shelton told people. We make biscuits, fish, sing together, spend time with the family, just a day in life. The simple pleasure of being together in one place for an extended period of time has been a real gift, he added. We cook, we clean, we ride our four-wheelers, and we just enjoy being with each other and with family. Shelton also praised his girlfriend of nearly five years, noting, An okie boy and a California girl look on paper like an unlikely match, but what matters is she's a great human being. She's the most understanding and kind-hearted person I've ever met and I learn something from her every day.